crossing that. So. Right. So, man, I, I just want to thank you, man, just for being that Bible for the people who never go to church. And we have to become the Bible that people would never read. You know what I mean? So every time I see you doing something, no matter what I'm doing or whatever, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to make it to your show because it is you're one of my favorite artists um, and I always support you. Um, and we want to get into the video, so let's set up to the... Well, let's take me back to uh, what we're coming up next, and that's uh, Take Me Back video, Deacon Das, and we'll be right back after this. Genesis, the fan in the window, AC wasn't fixed, chilling in the crib, this is what we did, the Fresh Prince intro, do you remember this, when Ewing was a Nick, we all rooted for the Bulls like Mike, but who was cooler than Mitch, I reminisce before Hogan pulled the switch, to Hollywood and Barry Sanders called it quits, I'm shooting from the hip, OJ's car chase, Rodney King got paid Sneaking in my mom's purse, taking quarters for the arcade First love heartbreaks, it's hard to forget The church, it was a far place, I got to admit Growing up in the hood, Lord you were there Working all things out, as I look at my past You see it wasn't all good, but it wasn't all bad As I reflect on the times we had, man it takes me back To trying to get them papers on the block with them packs Packing them pistols, we was chasing after women When we wasn't chasing figures, used to lie like I hit it when I didn't Forgive me, let me get this out my system King was my man, but I had a thing for his sister I remember when me and Lo got robbed at gunpoint Selling so I quit it, started rapping in my mama's basement Like Tigger, before my bro got locked up Team got shot up, we didn't have a babysitter Television watch us, saw Pookie get rocked up And New Jack City and Dashiki got knocked up And don't be a minute, yeah, I smoke, but I didn't inhale Clinton, in school suspension, being sent to detention That's when I wasn't skipping As I sit here flipping through these pictures Reminiscing, man, it takes me back
And welcome back to Barry's Poetic Session with Deacon Dash. You just saw the video, Take Me Back. How did that come about? Take Me Back. It was one of those beats I heard, and it just makes you reflect. Sometimes you hear instrumental, yeah. or you hear you may hear jazz or some kind, and the, and the beat just takes you to a place. And that just put me in the mind state of my childhood, even before writing any lyrics or anything like that. Just the beat and production was like, man, that take me back. Right. And it was like, right. wow, that's where we going. It took me back. So take me back to so a more re a reflective joint, uh, talking about the past, uh, my personal past, and the past of every, uh, most people in my, in my generation growing up throughout the 90s and the early 2000s, uh, the different things that we witnessed and that were popular in right. the world and the U.S. and uh, the different struggles that a lot of people dealt with individually. Uh, take me back. It's on my project Through the Dust. It's a free promotional project that's available on the website deacondas.com. D E A C O N D A S, Deacon Das dot com. So you can get that song. It sounds like the Telestai and others for free on the website. That's what's so. up. So if y'all just tuning in, Deacon Das is in the building. This is my cat right here, one of my favorite Christian rappers right now. Is doing it big. Oh man. So we analyzing his new album, his new CD. Um, otherworldly, Deacon Daz. First of all, man, you the bomb.com with the CD covers. Like, whoever <laughs> does this. I, my my brother-in-law, he did my CD cover. I was like, man, how can we get our stuff like this? How can we get it popping like that? Who who did this for I got to give a shout out to Larissa Leeper from Day One Creations. Uh, she is amazing. She has done like 90% of my graphic work and art design. She did the website. Uh, she also uh, did work for The Truth. Yeah, okay. Uh, the uh, album cover for The Truth uh, does work for Clear, Clear Sight, which is Flames label. Okay. Uh, Rep the King magazine and different things like that. So she is talented and she is amazing and she is always busy. So it's kind of dead. But she is like, I, in my opinion, probably the best doing it in or outside of the kingdom. Uh, and I, I love her to death. I love her to death. So did you have a lot of input on how you wanted this to be? Or you just let, or you just let her, her do it? I let her do her, man. I learned, I learned early, like, messing with her. Like, man, this is, this is the title. Like, when she did Losing My Religion yeah, cover, yeah, this okay. is the title. Bam. There it it's is. Like, she's like, okay, let's take a couple pictures. I, I told her I wanted to be close up. Right. I did tell her that. I was like, I want to be close up because on all most of my other covers, like my whole body on the uh, <laughs> <laughs> my whole body on the cover. So I wanted to be close up. That's the only thing I told her, and she made it dope. She made it. She did. That's yeah, she outstanding. Now, if you're just real, real quick. Um, we saw just take me back. How long did it take you to make that video? Take me back. We sh we shot it. We shot it in over the course of about a week and a half. Uh, we did the main stuff in in two days, and then there were some scenes we wanted to come and get right and redo. Uh, shout out to Donnie D Mob. They all know D Mob. Mm -hmm. uh, D Mob shot the video, edited the video. Wow. Okay. Uh, and yeah, it over the course of a week and a half or so, and then another three or four weeks for editing and putting it together. But it turned out pretty dope, pretty dope at the time. Uh, I think that was my first solo video I did for one of my individual songs. Did a lot of stuff with different artists where I'm featured on their music yeah. and in their videos. So okay. that was my first one in about two and a half years. Well, we want to check out this video because we talked about the song earlier, and we would just want to give it over. Check out that video, and then we're going to come back, uh, take, take a couple more questions about that, and we'll be right back. Give it over.
Man, now how could I be so impulsive That I would get involved and ignore what I've been taught Should've walked away from that pitfall Should've been smart, would've went home But I rushed into it like Limbaugh Just to lose what I did on the add injuries to that insult Sin is no different than investing what made off It's a rip-off, expensive And it's never really worth what it cost it It cost me my right hand when I miss that mark I try to stand but I just fall Get slapped around just like pinball But I believe in a guy who could restore So I reach for him in the midst of the storm I rejoice Lifting my arms in. Even though it gets hard I know I can look to his cross And though I got big problems I serve a bigger God And when I'm down to nothing He's up to something that's real tough Let me know All my worries and cares Carry the snow With the burdens I bear It's taking too heavy to hold On this weary road And I just can't take it no more So take control It's time to give it over 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 I can't give it over Try to be super, but this flesh is like kryptonite How can I say that I live for Christ When I know inside that I'm not living right Contrite, injured, trying to reach that finish line As wicked as the night, crippled my vision's blind Tempted and enticed by the world and desensitized It's like I minimize your word and can't put up a fight When only your will can turn that fortune around like man or white When it seems like that I miss my flight You come right in the nick of time I'm reminded that you gotta hold on me and your grip is tight Still in control Even when I can't get this right It's when I'm down to nothing You're up to something that's big in spite of me All my worries and cares Carry the slow with the burdens I bear It's taking too heavy to hold On this weary road And I just can't take it no more So take control It's time to give it over Going through, but one thing that I know is true is grace is God's to give, and it's not yours to lose. With a precious gift, with a precious jewel, it's not about what you've done, but what He did. What will you do? Cause though you feel lonely, broken pieces, and hopeless too, I'm hoping you will put your hope in Jesus. Hold on to His word. See, His joke is easy and His burdens light. Purchased this at a price when the fees was overdue. Just know He's not far at all. In fact, He's close to you, molding you. Just take a step back to see the whole view. He's working all things for the good of the chosen few. And when we're down to nothing, He's up to something that's beautiful. All my worries and cares Carry the slow with the burdens I bear It's taking too heavy to hold on this weary road And I just can't take it no more So take control It's time to give it over
And welcome back to Barry's Poetic Session with our special guest, Deacon Dast, in the video, Give It Over. And how long did it take for this Give It Over? Man, it took months for this one. <laughs> Wow. You had to put in some work. Huh? Had to put in some work. Now we shot a lot of scenes for that that didn't make it, and it's crazy because the video ended up being about six minutes long. The song's only four minutes long. Right. But we we had a story that we wanted to tell, so we had to adjust some some of the music in it to make it longer. Oh, okay. Uh, to make sure if we got the point across, the message across that we were trying to get in it. So, and, then, and there's a lot of scenes of me be, that were cut out of it. So that the story, <laughs> he said me. No, no, you no. sound like me. <laughs> yeah, I sound like me. So that the gonna story, cut me out of my own video. So that the story would make sense. Because the story was the most important. Exactly. It's the most important part of the video. So, yeah, we shot that. That would have been in February, and we released it in April. So it, about two months. So we shot it over the course of... Uh, Two or three days. Okay. Two or three days, and it took about two months to edit. So. <laughs> we know about that. Don't we? <laughs> but anyway, um, so man, so we if y'all just tuning in, Deacon Daz is in the studio with us. He's one of my favorite artists, um, and he's a Christian rapper in Cincinnati, Slow Ohio, and we're talking about his new CD, Otherworldly. We didn't even. We didn't even ask you what otherworldly mean. Otherworldly, I don't even know what it means. <laughs> nah, otherworldly, in this world but not of it. In this world Good. but not of it. Not that's of what this I world. Thought. Yeah, that's that's the most basic meaning of it. Of course, otherworldly also transcendent. Okay. Uh, to be transcendent. Uh, don't be consumed too. Yeah, before. to be transcendent and above. You, somebody hit a jump shot, you hear uh, Marv Albert or somebody go crazy. Oh, that was Kobe was otherworldly. Uh, <laughs> yes, don't sir. be hating if you're LeBron. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm a Kobe. Kobe. I'm a Lakers fan yeah. all day. But anyway. Kobe! Yeah! Um, now. We can't forget we, about your concerts that you wanted to bring up with Dick and Dan. Yeah. Well, we talked about that at the 86 Club when he did that. Um, you didn't say uh, where? With 86 Club, his 30th <laughs> birthday bash, right. he talked about that. But if you are just tuning in, we're talking the good and bad about the CD. Now, you know I came at you with this song. I thank you. So so then, Come Alive, and then Moon, and uh, then The Charm. So this beat is crazy, like some, 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 <laughs> like I was in New Orleans, voodoo. The Charm, right? The Charm. That's what I was supposed to do. So, and he told me, like, you know, it's a cautionary story. But if you li if that was the first song that I heard, like, so explain it, because it was like, I was like, wait a minute, what is he? You're talking some voodoo crazy stuff. Like, now, so, I wanted you know, to. Uh, you, know, <laughs> not, you hear the song yet, Barry? I was saying, uh, you don't know nothing about no voodoo. That yeah, they were just, right. <laughs> that's scary, yeah. man. Yeah, the charm. Everybody know the charm. The charm, like, uh, I think it was a television show. The yeah, Charm yeah, One. Right, the Charm. Yeah. yeah, so yeah. it's uh, to do with uh, witchcraft and that realm and different things like that. And I was like, man, no Christian artist had touched on this subject. Right. And that's why Not I was like. Not too many artists, period. Listen, when I heard this, I was like, the beat was crazy. It, it, it has you going like in it. Did he start talking this crazy stuff? I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I had to text you like, wait a minute, man. I love your CD, but what's up with this charm Are thing? You I, I did, that one right, I was like, I don't understand this, man. Nah, so it, it was a, because it's I, a because warning. I, yeah, because I told the story in first person. Like, yo, I've been practicing magic, and I've been doing this, and, and I've been doing this. I told it in the first person of someone who's being influenced by a friend to try this magic stuff. Right. So come and, come and try this. It's harmless, right. man. Nothing yeah. gonna happen from it. We just having fun, man. And magic <laughs> is real, man. And we can help people or whatever. Yeah. Like, so come on, let's just try it. And then they start getting consumed in it. Right. So I'm I'm getting consumed in this stuff, and I think I'm controlling these demons or whatever. Yeah. Under my control, 
and before I know it, they controlling me. That's right. the story. So it's, it's that sounds like a great movie. I should be in there. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> been playing. I guess. <laughs> but but it, yeah, it, it deals with witchcraft. Right. Is is the is the focal of the whole thing? Uh, but I told you, like, man, it's it's like an allegory. So yeah, it deals directly on the surface level with witchcraft, but also with any sin. Yeah. Like with any sin, it always looked. Like but, it's gonna be. But did you see that movie? I'm not gonna say the the big budget movie where they were the guy was like, you know, the character's name was Anakin. He wanted to have people live again and not die, and so he went to the dark side. Everybody knows the dark side, and that's similar to the same thing. And I'm not even gonna talk about my own personal scariness. <laughs> I don't know where you're going with this, but no, no. Do you know the? The, the girl who was supposedly Catholic who wanted to join a Wiccan, and I was like, wait a minute, what? Yeah. <laughs> so right. really dealing with that stuff, because nobody talks about it, right. really. Like, mm, we, right. people talk about it in private. Right, right. But it hasn't been talked about since Charles Manson back in the day. Yeah. But that's why you so dope, man. I don't think you know this. Because <laughs> this day and time, People talking about even Christian rappers are talking about stuff on the surface, or 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 you know in a secular world they're talking about uh, you know glorify money and this and this and this, and you went a little deep like all oh, this <laughs> like it captivated me like I didn't see this like as a movie or whatever so I'm into this like wait a minute but first you was like man I don't get what you're talking about that's man. why I had yeah. to touch you like yeah, and I had yeah. it ready I had it uh, but, go over but like, one thing one thing I did do that in a lot of the songs and all the songs on there except for right, maybe right or wrong a lot of songs on there were at the beginning of, of a lot of songs at the end of a lot of songs you hear artists say yeah, this song goes out to so and so or so and so mm -hmm. or whoever in the struggle or whatever, and kind of tell you what the song is about. Right. Like this is what the song this means. Is right. This is uh, how right. you should interpret this song. Uh, when I finished a lot of songs, I had I had that part in a lot of the songs and took it out. Like I'm not gonna tell you what I meant by this. Right. I want you to hear it. Yes. Hear it. Yes. And what it means to you when mm -hmm. you hear it. That's what you'll get from it. Right, so right. I won't direct you on how you should interpret this. Man, put your interpretation to it. I think you come, come with your lenses. If they foggy, you might see it the wrong way. Right. If they rose color, you might see it the wrong way right. the other way. Right. But if you come clear sight, clear vision, man, it's going gonna, it's gonna to make a lot of sense to you. Like, so I... <laughs> like, I'm not going to explain it to you. Like, like Jesus and his parents. Now, you, you my boy. Like, so you can hit me up and I can tell you what this was about. Like, that's right. what I meant by that. Right. Like, just like the disciples came to Jesus, like, man, what you mean when you said, man, these seeds falling by the wayside and they is, like, he can explain it to them that way. Right, right. But for most people, they ain't going. Right. And I think that's what we missing today. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if you dope, we know you dope. We know you can sling the words or whatever and put the words together and everything to tell a story, to go even deeper than that, to have me thinking, because what you just said is, is crazy, because, so if I didn't know you, I'm thinking, I'm, you got me thinking. That's not happening today. <laughs> Message! <laughs> We're not thinking today. Music is like, oh, you shake your booty and stinky leg and this.